Okay guys, I thought I'd show you where I'm up to with the studio lounge. This is the lounge area. Um, hopefully you can see the lights coming in against the window, so it's quite difficult. But I've now got two sofas in this area. And my monitor set up where I sit and watch TV. Got some artwork up on the walls. I'm going to change that round, I think. Doesn't fit the mood. <laughs> going to put some of my more gothic paintings up in this area. Uh, I swapped my table because this glass table makes the space feel a bit more open and I've put a mirror down there which eventually is going to go up on the wall but at the moment it's just down there because it makes the space feel a bit wider. Here's Miss Maddie who's got a whine today. What are you whining about Miss Maddie? Tell us what's the matter with you today. What's the matter with us Miss Maddie? Tell us what's the matter? She's been whining all morning because Arnie's gone out for the day, haven't, hasn't he? Yes, Arnie's gone out for the day, so he, she's all whiny and huffy. Poor baby girl. Are you bored? Are you bored, Miss Maddie? Tell us. Tell us, Maddie, are you bored? Where's Arnie? You're such a cheeky girl, aren't you? She's almost two. She's going to be two years old next week. She's not impressed. Okay, anyway, back to the room. Um, my inspiration board. Put some new stuff up on there. I've put darker curtains up um, because the net curtains I had up, with this being a lounge as well now, it was not private enough people could see in so um I've got mostly books and things over here now books and notebooks and boxes of paper and stuff um all my creative books are out there that pile there there's kitty with her little hop along leg hi kitty um I've got a dumping shelf there for things that I need to take downstairs with me as I go. That's working very well. Just having a little spot right by the door for things that... And it's right at eye level too, so I can't forget to take things downstairs. Uh, this is all like business cards and things that I just sometimes need to grab as I go out the door. Uh, this table is going. This table's going downstairs. Uh, we're actually going to use it as a garden table. Um, all of that is stuff that needs to be either posted out or it's finished artwork that needs sorting or it's, you know, all sorts of bits and pieces that just need hanging up. I've got my sewing machine over here and you can see it's got a big flap on it and that's going to open up into that space and when I'm not using my sewing machine my chair will go there next to it. Uh, this is all pretty much the same. I've got all my basic stuff that I use all the time on this little trolley. Um, and I can then wheel that round to the other side if I need to use it. All my paints and stuff are up there, my inks. I've got my collage box and I put a box together here of current projects and other stuff. Um, so anything that I'm working on regularly or stuff that I'm putting aside for a specific project. That all goes in there. In this cabinet I've got at the bottom I've got my mediums, my big um, bucket of mediums and gessos and all that sort of stuff. Glues. And then in here I've got brand new canvases and dog biscuits <laughs> where the puppies can't get hold of them. Uh, miscellaneous tools, big stuff that I don't want on my desk all that kind of thing. I've got my scanner out where I can use it. This is all, uh, all that is uh, art stuff that I use on a regular basis. So like the stamps that I use, my glittery stuff, my paints, all that sort of thing. Um, this is all photographs, papers and rubber stamps. And then at the top I've got current notebooks, uh, current reference books and cat biscuits where the dogs can't get them. <laughs> See there's method in my madness. This is the new kitty palace over here. Crow's enjoying sitting by me. 
uh, my computer desk and I've got my obviously my scanner is set up where I can plug it into my laptop I've got my main computer there so I can sit and watch movies while I'm editing as well or rendering or videoing or whatever and I've also managed to get my printer set up down there so I don't have to keep plugging it and unplugging it all the time uh, I don't really use that computer an awful lot um, mostly I just use it for as a backup server um, it's kind of just sat there with all my stuff on it rather than being used as an everyday computer but I do use it sometimes um, I use, mostly use my laptop which is on here along with it looks a horrendous mess at the moment but that's because I've been doing some stuff this morning um, I've got some pencils and stuff out those normally live on my trolley behind me I've got my two little knickknacks with my brushes and things in that always lives there I've got a pot of candles various other debris is stuff that I've been using this morning <laughs> um, all of this is stuff that I've been using today as well this is just paints and pencils and stuff all of this goes back on that trolley when I'm done and then this hodgepodge is my inbox so post that's come in uh, letters that have come in, mail art that's come in um, anything that I need to reply to, anything that I'm working on that needs to be sent out um, so rather than current projects like the big box is current projects for me um, like my um, Art Geek scrapbook album and stuff like that this is more stuff that I'm working on for other people swaps and things um, I've got my camera set up on a permanent basis now I've got my other camera up there so when I'm doing Wing It Wednesday all I'll have to do is turn it round and there it is so that's really useful I've got everything set up there um, this desk uh, my flatmate wants to use it downstairs as, uh, as the kitchen table so uh, I'm actually swapping this desk with the big desk downstairs but it won't take up any more room because it's simply going to go like from where the desk is now it'll come out to maybe here so it's not going to take up any more floor space because I've already got stuff down there anyway just means that stuff will be under the desk and yes under the desk I have an absolute hodgepodge of stuff and apparently a a sweet packet that Maddie's pulled out of the trash uh, that is a box of frames I've got my box of journals down there those two crates are full of journals that's full of frames this is full of um, finished artwork pieces and canvas boards and odd bits and pieces that I need to sort out so anything that's in a box currently still needs to be sorted but other than that it's pretty much laid out how I want it and it really just needs a good tidy um, but as anyone who regularly does artwork will tell you there is not always it's not always possible to keep everything clean and tidy <laughs> it just isn't I don't think it's just me um, I honestly I refuse to believe that some of these workspaces where everything's clean and pristine and put away and everything's measured to the within an inch of its life and everything I refuse to believe that they either know half of the stuff they've got or that they ever make anything in there I, I just do I can't see how you can possibly be making and creating stuff and not leave a mess behind it's not possible well it's not possible for me anyway <laughs> so uh, yeah that's the that's the um, new workspace as it's laid out now here's Miss Maddie, hello Miss Maddie oh she's such a pretty girl she's bored today she's bored because Arnie's gone out Arnie's gone out Helen took Arnie out so poor baby mm -mm -mm -mm. ooh ooh Okay, I think I'll go and brush my teeth now.